Well, just on the facts alone, I mean, if you look at where, how many people are unemployed today as opposed to four years ago, you're looking at about a half a million less people employed today than four years ago. Gas is higher. Health care is higher. The, he, the president promised that he would cut the deficit in half by the end of his first term. Obviously, we've had the biggest structural deficits in the history of the world, some of which uh, obviously uh, proposed by Barack Obama, obviously didn't pass as... Uh, congressman pointed out. The, the nice thing about where we're at, and it's unfortunate, but you know, the facts going in the closing argument are on our side. And there's nothing better in a closing argument than having the facts on your side. Here's another issue, too, that we don't talk enough about. We forget about the fact that Barack Obama, four years ago, campaigned in an economy that was difficult. But he campaigned on that economy, campaigned that he would fix that economy. Now, either he didn't understand the gravity of what he was doing or walking into, and or he completely failed. But it's one or both of those outcomes. Either he didn't understand what he was doing, or, excuse me, and or he failed. 